Hi guys, it's Adam and welcome to the eBay portion of the 50 Charity Shop haul video. So, I'm going to be quite quick with this one. I'm going to get through it really quick because time is getting on for me. It's Tuesday morning at the moment and I need to get hustling, get going, get moving. So, I do need to be fairly quick now. So, I'll just sort of go through it. I, I don't want to take up a ton of your time. You know, when I can do something faster, why not just do it faster, you know? So... I got this frustration for £1.50. I sold this from anywhere from 10, 10 to £14. Pound. Um, £14 pound being in fourth quarter. Um, I might hold out for a bit higher and let it sit for a little bit. Or I might just shift it for, you know, £10 odd. Um, but yeah, so that's that one. Um, so, where am I going to put things now? Let's go down there. That was in the free for a pound with the Hitman and the Call of Duty Black Ops that I showed in the last haul. I got something that I've been looking out for. They're not on my bucket list or anything, but Kellogg's Fruit and Fibre Bowl for 79p and Kellogg's Special K Bowl for 79p. Don't know what these are really going for, but I think they go better in bigger lots. So, I don't know, maybe... Maybe like four of them are going for like 15 quid, something around that. I don't know. So I might hold out for a few more of them, but I don't really see them that much. So I don't know. Mafia for the PC. One to look out for this one. I mean, it's not mega money or anything, but it's just one that, you know, you can look out for. Um, probably about 14, 15 quid for that. Paid £2.50. Make sure it's got its uh, map and everything in there. It's got its map there behind that. And it's got its three discs. So, yeah, that's that one. Um, I got a Ravensburger puzzle. I can't sell this on Amazon, unfortunately. But there's not that much of a price difference between eBay and Amazon. Um, probably shift it for about £14.99 on eBay. It might sit for a little bit, but not too long, I don't think. I could shift it for about 12 13 quid and get a very, very quick sale on that. But, um... But yeah, I think maybe hold out for a bit longer, uh, a bit higher even. Um, yeah, so two ninety nine paid on that. Right, where am I going here now? I got this jacket, it's a rather nice, big, bulky one. It's by Avenue. I'll just show you the tag there. Eight pound paid, and where's the tag? It's by Avenue there. Uh, yeah, it's a fairly nice one. I don't really know what I can get back for this, so I'm going to put it up there. But I would suspect minimum sort of like £20 plus postage, so I've not lost money anyway. But it was a bit of a pump, that one. Um, but yeah, so that's that. Put that over there. I got... Right, where am I going next? I got a free, uh, four DVDs for £2. Toy Story 1 and Toy Story 2, like little... I don't know limited edition pack or something space buddies and mickey the mouse or something i don't know some sort of thing there anyway they'll bundle up nicely jimmy neutron figure for four pound this was in one of the last charity shops i really didn't know what i was doing and just picked it up um but it turns out it's worth about 15 quid so i'm not going to lose money on it a bit of profit in there but if I was thinking a little bit more, you know, correctly, you know, I was a little bit less tired, I might not have picked it up. So, yeah, anyway, that's that one. Um, Sims 2 base game, this is the first charity shop I went in, the big box edition with the four discs. Paid 150 Going to bundle it with some other expansions. I really don't know what these bundles are commanding anymore, but I used to be able to get, like, 25 quid, like, just with, like, six expansions. But I think it's probably, like... More like eight expansions for 20 quid in the base game. So, yeah, they are going down in price, I think. Um, yeah, told you all then. Right, we're on to the bed now. Um, took a punt on a bit of clothing again. Because, as I say, I do want to get into clothing a little bit more. Just so that I'm a bit more confident. Um, now, obviously, I don't know whether these are real or fake or not. I'm not down with that. Um, but these are Levi 565 wide leg. I mean, the you know, it looks real to me, but I don't know, do I? I have no clue. So I might post it in the uh, Is It Real or Is It Fake group. Um, but yeah, they're fairly nice condition, to be fair. I paid £2 for these, so that was really good. Um, so £2 for these. 
But I don't know whether the style's very good. I don't know whether that's what people are going to be wanting, to be fair. I, I personally don't think it's the best style, so I might have a little bit of trouble shifting them. Um, I don't really know for what these are going to go for, so I'm going to put it up there. Um, but yeah, they are quite slim as well. Um, oh, it's size 28. That's where I used to be, but now I'm size 30. Um, but yeah, size 28. Um, getting older, I'm getting bigger. Um, yeah, so size 28. So yeah, maybe not the best size actually, but for two quid, I thought I'd take a punt on them. Um, so that's those. I finally got one, and it's not anything special at all. I got a TM Lewin shirt for a quid. So happy. And it's in good condition as well. Uh, these sort of generally go for, I think, about 13 quid. I've not done too much research into them. Maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, but they're not much at all, really. Um, but for a quid, you know, a nice little bread and butter item. Um, and it's a funky looking shirt, to be fair. Pretty cool. Um, you know, I'd wear that. I'm not a fancy guy. I'm not bothered about brands and all that sort of stuff. I just, if I like it, I like it. That's 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 what it is with me. Um, but yeah, checked all around. It, it, it is in good condition. Maybe a little bit of an iron up. Uh, yeah, I will, I will iron it up actually. Um, but yeah, so that's that one. So I'll just punt on that for a quid. But for three pound all in, what do I stand to lose? Three pound. So I thought I'm picking them two up. Um, Mirror Mirror for 250 again, I don't know, I just picked this up, like, I scanned it into Amazon and I don't even think it was on there, or even if it was, it wasn't worth picking up, um, like it was a ridiculous wank or something, but I decided to pick, pick it up for 250 and maybe just see what it goes for on eBay, I really don't know what that, that is, but I'll put a price up there, um, and yeah, so, so that's that one, uh, I really don't know what that, I just picked it up, um, Next item, um, yeah, that's that one. I got this, uh, I think it's the Heffalump or something, Disney, um, for four quid. Again, I apologise, but I don't know what this is going for. I would search it on my phone, but it might take forever, and I don't want to just, like, eat into the video time. Um, so, yeah, four pound. It's got its official Disney stamp on it. Um, and, yeah, pretty cool. I always pick up the unusual Disney plushies, you know, things that aren't really Mickey Mouse or Minnie Mouse, um, things that are a bit different, you know, stuff like that, so I always pick them up, so that's why I picked that up. Um, what else? Only a couple more bits now. I don't even know why or what these are, I don't know why I picked them up and I don't know what they are. Um, but I know the data storage or something, but I haven't a clue. £2 for the five of these, new sealed... Um, yeah, I, I, I don't know, DLT tape uh, IV in Roman numerals, 40 slash 80 gigabyte, I don't know, Maxell, it's Maxell anyway, so, um, but yeah, £2 for that, for that stack of five, £2 for that stack of five, I'm going to put it up there, because as I say, I don't want to eat up a load of time researching it now, um, but yeah, got them. Haven't a clue, might be stellar, they might be awesome, or they might be pretty much a fail, but anyway. And finally, something I don't really see in charity shops that much are Wii Fit boards, um, and definitely not boxed anyway, at least I don't, and I go to charity shops a lot, so yeah, I don't see them. Um, and I got this for £5 boxed, there's no software with it, but I've got a stack of software, I've got... I've got about six Wii Fit Pluses and about four or five Wii Fit, so, you know, software. So, easy put a stock software with it. 25, something like that, maybe a bit more, but, yeah, something like that. So, that's the final item, guys. My voice is actually going. I've been talking for the best part of 40 minutes now between both videos. So, I will see you in the next one, guys. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe if you haven't already. Do all the normal things, like, comment, all that sort of stuff. And if you haven't already, please do visit my Facebook page. Um, if you like both of these videos, obviously, feel free to tell me that you like it. Tell me where, uh, what I've done right, what I've done wrong. Tell me what you like about the videos, all that sort of stuff, because it really does help me out. And I will see you in the next one. So, thanks a lot. See you very soon.